Eagles trying to press and Crawford wins it on the 18 yard line but stabs it straight back to Louis oh, he's Mulden. In, he's in, he's in. Oh, and there's a ball over the top straight towards the, the Rochdale oh, no. player who chips Dixon. The flag stays down. And this is a nightmare start for Hartlepool United who concede within two and a half minutes. A long ball punted over the top. And it was all too easy for Key and Haynes to run through on goal. Dixon had come out an awful long way. And it was just clipped over the pool's keeper and nestled into the back of the net. As Ebanks Landell takes up possession inside his own half. Away to our left-hand side. Now Gilmore being watched closely by Featherston. Out to the left once more for Uchi Bolam, a sliding challenge from Dolan, doesn't get there, might open Sorry. it up for Mitchell, the offside flag stays down, this is an opportunity once more as a cross-field ball comes all the way through to this near side, it's going to be kept in by Aduro, now Gilmore looking to deliver into the box, but it's low towards Henderson, trying to lay it off perhaps to Kia Henderson, he comes out to the right-hand side for Uduro, goes down inside the box, the referee waves away the advances, the shot comes in, and it's wide of Joel Dixon's right-hand post. Ryan East, a short worked corner. Back to East once more, tries to curl it. It comes off Featherston. Peels for a handball, but this might be an opportunity for Pills to counter. But there's a real lack of urgency to get up the pitch. Joel Gray is trying to drag his team up to the halfway line. There was nobody really with him, and he was dispossessed by Keen Hayes. And now Pills. Regain possession with Gray. Curls one into the penalty area. That's inviting towards Desiree. All the way through to Ferguson. Lays it off for Crawford. Crawford, oh, curling effort. That is just touched round the left-hand post of Louis Mulden. And Crawford, who already has three goals for the season, almost found his fourth. Yeah, it was a great uh, save from the goalkeeper. Crawford just curled it from the edge of the box. And Out to the left-hand side. Featherson's quite high up the pitch, he isn't, isn't he? he? A lot yeah. of the time now, he's he's either the one trying to make a run or he's the one that's going to press. Still trying to figure out what exact system pulls are playing. Is it a four-two-three-one? Is it a? Yeah, by the looks of it, they've got Matty, but now Matty's in front, and then so they've got a. It's well, it's really disjointed at the moment because Joel yeah. Gray's back there as well, so. Yeah, it's not really well, Nicky Featherstone's on the right hand side at the moment and Matty's sitting in behind so it looks and Chris Ray's on this left hand side Manny Desiree is up top on his own and Crawford's just behind him yeah I think it should be a 4-2 with Featherstone and Dolan in there but uh, Joe Gray's just sitting because they, they can't get into position if you like until yeah. the ball goes out Ian Henderson on the halfway line 730 career appearances amazing, for Ian Henson. Amazing. It's incredible. And to, to what he looks really sharp, doesn't he? He looks really fit. Oh, oh no. flicked on oh header no. from Cairo Mitchell. And oh. Rochdale are in once more and have beaten Joel Dixon once more. And this time it's Jimmy Keohan who doubles the score for Rochdale. And it was one simple ball, a flick on header from Mitchell into the path of Keohan who finds his fifth goal of the season it was scuffed into the turf and it trickled painfully across the goal line Hartlepool United are all at sea as far as Featherston the only option he's got to hit though is Manny Desirue Joe Gray tries to provide an option the ball into Manny Desirue is hit back the way it came now Henderson six minutes of stoppage time a shot from distance oh, oh and it beats Joel Dixon away to his left hand side and it's Ryan East who struck that one from distance it bounced up in front of Dixon he probably should have done better with that but Pools in 45 minutes find themselves 3-0 down and with questions being asked the team looks all out of answers. Yeah, and again, right dominating the two centre-halves. He's coming when he shouldn't really get the ball. And Joel Dixon's come out almost to the base of the centre circle to collect it. Launched long onto the chest of Chris Ray, wide on the left-hand side. Now Featherston with the studs on top of the ball. and looks to lift one in, into Good the ball. area. Controlled by Gray. Featherston shot, scores! And Nick 
Ricky Featherston on the day when he surpasses 385 appearances for the club gets his first of the season going to be an in-swinger from the far side plenty of yellow shirts to pick from Ian Henderson right underneath Joel Dixon he goes to the back post and Desiree back there defending but the final touch coming off a Rochdale shirt so it is whether they get it is a is another conversation altogether as Joe Matic oh, heads it straight towards Cairo Mitchell who hits one from distance and actually clatters the advertising boards above the goal you're listening to BBC Radio T Sport the voice there of Mickey Barron former Hartlepool United captain in his day every kick of every Hartlepool United game this season with us on BBC Radio T Sport on your DAB digital radio and on the BBC football website whichever way you're listening to us this afternoon thank you for your company Pools trailing 3-1 here against the Dale who sit a point in a place below them they will be climbing up the table this afternoon if it stays like this this could be another opportunity for Rochdale Ryan East swings his boot at it and hangs up in the air and a good height in the end for Joel Dixon away to Good afternoon for Spenny Moore. Not so good for the Quakers who remain bottom of the National League North. Here in Hartlepool this afternoon in the National League. John Askey's side trailing 3-1 against the Dale. It's been a much more of a contest in this second half but Poole's still getting opened up at the back. A ball forward for Ian Henderson. Oh, a good sliding well. challenge from Matic to just disrupt the stride of Henderson and I wonder if this is going to be a similar routine we've seen in the past where Joel Gray just rolls it into the path for either Gray, uh, either Ferguson oh. or Crawford it is a shot from Crawford it goes through a crowd of bodies oh, oh, it's scrambled by the oh. goalkeeper who gathers it at the second attempt and the referee is given a free kick and now there is a bit of pushing and shoving in the six still Middlesbrough nil, Stoke City 2-0 over in the championship on 95 FM this afternoon Adam Clayton in possession for Rochdale at the halfway line infield it goes a sliding challenge from Ferguson doesn't quite get there an opportunity for Hayes twisting oh, turning he drills oh. one wide of the right hand pause and David Ferguson is absolutely spitting blood at his centre backs because that was way too easy and Keen Hayes twisted turned swivel of the hips found his way right onto the edge of the area but pulled his shot thankfully Oops, wide Crawford right. to Ray stands his man up he's got Desiree Way and Gray inside the area Crawford turns plays it to Adjumang over to Hendry on this near side right hand side of the box tries to dink one oh, in towards Desiree oh, oh and he's on they got it scored Manny Desiree his 11th of the season and with 8 minutes left to play and waves his teammates forward Hendry's pulled up with a. He looks like he's he pulled. His thigh, it, it looked it? like he pulled his side when he put the cross in for the. Oh, oh. no, Manny Dizarouwe tries to lift the ball over the head of the defender. It might fall for Chris Ray. This would be a great time to score your first goal. Oh. The shot is saved only as far oh, as Gray, who can't quite get there, and it's hooked clear. One goal in it. We've got stoppage time left to come. Oh, back oh, heel from Adjumang, open space up for Featherson at the byline. Oh, it's yes. Oh, oh Desiree no. Way completely oh, misses miss. it in front of goal. Desiree Way with the goal gaping. 